What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Cardboard Moses, a.k.a. Uncle Jesse. Here to bring you Donruss football, half case number four, eBay style. Join me, will you? Here is the rest of the half case. Now, this thing is going to take a long time. I can't even, like, sugarcoat this. Nine boxes. Here they are. We going one by one on this deal. There is no actual right way to do this. You know, I did a half case where I, you know, opened up every single pack first, and then I did another half case where I just went box by box and I found that you know the box by box is slightly faster that and I think I developed a new way to open up the packs so there you go Yo, sports cards freak. I know you know a whole bunch of people, dog. So can you can you hook your boy up with like a graphic designer so we can get these uh, Rip City cards T-shirts made, bruh? You know, I'm thinking outside the box now. I don't want like a a T-shirt though. I want like a baseball jersey. I want a football jersey, a hockey jersey, and a basketball jersey with the rip city cards logo on it you know what i'm saying a hat would be dope like a fitted with the rip city cards logo on it that would be dope that will probably run a grip i mean we have the design and i could take it to lids to get it printed out there but i would need a, a file converter because it's a special file for uh things to get embroidered because that's what they do at lids you know they do the embroidery and whatnot I just need the file converter, which is, you know, a special file, obviously. I mean, trust me, I've tried Googling it, and I just, I, I, got, I would have to pay for it. A Rip City Cards windbreaker would be so dope. A Rip City Cards hoodie? What? What? That would be dope as hell. And it's going to be in Miami colors, you know what I'm saying? It'd be like a like a teal teal aqua green hoodie with that logo on there. That would look so pimp. That would look so pimp. Heat colors or sports cars freak. You remember when the LeBrons came out, the South Beach LeBrons? Where they were like teal and pink and black. So, so slick. That's that's the colorways that I'm, I'm shooting for. And straight black and white. Because uh, I'm all about the, uh, you know, the, the elegant stuff. Not all of you want loser Miami colors. Well, that's why I just came up with my black and white collection. You know, for, for the inner goth. If you guys want to listen to, to Panic at the Disco or whatever. Yeah, dude, like Miami Vice the what? All right, whatever. Let's get let's get into it. Alright, so there is a whole bunch of color in this stuff. It's one auto and one relic per box. Dantari Poe to 25 for the Chiefs. Die cut right there. Did I mention there's a lot of color? There's a good amount of color in this. I want to see some crazy auto come out of here. 
I will do my best. Look, there's a Miami card right there. JGI insert. Oh, sports cards freak. You are something else. You are something else. What up, Dolphin Fanatic? Nice. Andrew Luck, number to 100 for the Colts. What up, Dolphin Fanatic? Dude, Jake Cutler looks pretty decent in uh, Miami Dolphins colors. <laughs> LOL. Running back for the Buccaneers, Doug Martin, Relic to 99. Oh, for sure you can, Sports Cards Freak. Anything is possible here at Rip City Cards. Dolphin Fanatic, how do you feel about the whole Jake Cutler situation? I honestly feel like it's not going to be much of a drop-off going from Tannehill to, uh, to that guy. It's possible, Sports Cards Freak, it's possible. Let's, so let's find out together, shall we? I hit a I hit that auto yesterday, Curtis Martin. That was pretty nice. You're cool with it. You're a lot uh, better at it than I am. That's for sure. Cause uh, I mean I'm over it now. Honestly, I don't think there'll be much of a drop off from Tannehill to Cutler. Quan Alexander to 75 die cut for the Bucks. I mean, they're both equally mediocre, so uh, there's that. Just hand the ball off to Ajayi. Just, just hand the ball off. I, I don't like Cutler either, but I really don't like Tannehill. So it's about the same. I just have somebody else to, you know, dislike now. Except for this guy, Michael Thomas to 100 for the Saints. That's a good player right there. Nothing to dislike about that. There's just going to be a whole bunch of interceptions being thrown this season by the Dolphins. Or who knows, man? Who knows? Who knows? Adam Gaze, I'm going to trust the process. You know, I, I liked what he did his first year with the Dolphins, so we'll see. Alan Hearns to 88 for the Jaguars. Did I mention there's a bunch of color in this? To 100, Terrence Williams of the Cowboys. The first game of the, I think is what? What's today, Tuesday? So Thursday would be the first game, actually. I forget who we play. I think we play the Falcons in the preseason. Todd Gurley the second, one out of 50 for the Rams. Uh, sports Cards Freak, I'm going to say no. Simply because it's going to make the package heavier, thus more expensive to ship. But if you come pick them up, I got you. And I'll give you a t-shirt, Sports Cards Freak. Oh, damn. That is a good card. Troy Aikman, 6 out of 10. Auto for the, uh, for the Cubs, for the Cowboys. I can't even speak. That's such a nice card. That is nice. So nice, in fact. Oh, you already know. It gets the Uncle Jesse... Instant top load. Uh, no, you're going to pick them up while there's somebody here. Because I'm not about to leave the office by myself. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to give you the treatment of you better come before the, uh, the street lights come on. I'm going to take it back to, back, to the, back to the good old days. 
when back when the curfew was, you better be home before the street lights come on. Which I never was, but I'm a, I'm gonna put it into effect for you, sports cards free. All right, so that first box was fire because of that Aikman. So whoever has the Cowboys, good job. It got to be safety first, though, Fanatic. You know what I'm saying? I'm not about to, you know, walk outside and potentially get murdered. Number to 400, Tyrod Taylor. I mean, truth be told, the Metro Rail is like right there. And it's been known to be uh, quite dangerous at night. All right, so uh, sports cars freak. I'm gonna be here till probably midnight. You've never been on the Metro Rail, see? You see what I'm saying? And you want to come over and like just all willy nilly, you know, just stroll on over? Yeah, no. My mom told me not to talk to strange men on the internet. My mom also told me not to meet strange men from the internet in real life. Sports car freak. So you gonna tell me my mom is wrong? My mother is a saint! If you can guess what movie that's from, I might just give you a high five or something. Listen, I ride the Metro Rail, like, to, to, to downtown, like, all the time. Like, if I want to go to Bayside or, like, a heat game, I'm taking that Metro Rail, baby. For under $5, baby, I'm there. And I don't even got to pay for the garage, because I can just park it here, baby. Hashtag, say that money. That's an actual song, by the way. Oh, you had to Google it, didn't you, Sports Cards Freak? And you're still wrong. It was actually Vince Vaughn. And, uh... Dang it, what's the name of that movie? No, you're right. It was Step Brothers. No, it wasn't. It was Anchorman. But the line was also set in Step Brothers. But the one I'm thinking of was Anchorman. You know, when they're about to fight, and then Will Ferrell starts going in on Vince's, Vince Vaughn's mom. Or somebody said something about Vince Vaughn's mom, and then Vince Vaughn's, Vince Vaughn's mom was like, Oh, hell no. My mother's a saint. You watch your mouth. Or something like that. I never saw part two, but from what I hear, it's terrible. Like, Charles Barkley terrible. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. That's true. If you can dodge a wrench, you can indeed dodge a ball. All good movies. Actually, I think the, the same dude directed all those movies. Judd Apatow? He's probably my favorite director when it comes to, like, the comedy as of, like, the last 10 years. He's directed some really, really funny movies. Like, I remember back in the day, Adam Sandler and his crew were, like, pretty much holding it down. They had the comedy Monopoly, where it'd be, like, the same crew of actors in every Adam Sandler movie. Kind of like the same deal now, except with like Seth Rogen and you know, and the, and the boys. Alright, so. What's up, Davis? Let's 
see what's in here. Uh, well, there's not much in the store, Davis. So, pretty much what you see is pretty much what we got. We're going to have to put in, like, mixers and stuff like that, Davis. Number to 75. Papa's Lesney for the Jaguars die cut. See, there you go. He's He is working his magic. He did come into the, the 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 office for like maybe like an hour. Checked the inventory and was like, "All right, boom, I'm out." So that is him loading it up. I think we got like two cases of that Bowman draft. Number 66 of 83, Brian Quick of the Redskins. Even though he's in a Rams uniform, that's a Redskins hit. The first hit was Troy Aikman to 10. Chris Fitz, you see it back there. To 100, Joe Flacco of the Ravens. I really need to look into like some music to play in the background here. It would have to be some like public domain stuff. Number to 100, Odell Beckham Jr. for the Giants. You know, it's even sicker if I actually show it to you. Chris Fitz. Look at that. That's a that's like a drawing. That's not a that's not like a picture. That's nice. You know, if you like nice things. That's a, a Buccaneers Doug Martin relic. We got an auto here for the Bills. Oh, that's nice looking, man. Dominator for the Bills. 19-25, LaShawn McCoy. That's another good card. That is another nice card. Fantasy football warrior right here. Two good autos in back-to-back -back boxes? Okay. Okay. Alyssa, can I have 55 count top loaders? Like two of them and a whole bunch of 400 count boxes, please? There you go. Is that you? all? Oh, oh, oh. wait. A L B R S H B R. I don't even know how to like say that. Numbered fifteen of twenty-five. Alfred Morris for the Cowboys. Sabers got it. Well, my man, I appreciate you joining uh, joining the, us here in the room, watching the break live. You know, you also do save $10 off your first purchase through the store. Thank you, Jones. Oh, look at this. 
Nice Hall of Famer running back relic Barry Sanders. Game used too, baby. That's nice for the lines right there. Thank you, Jones. Yeah, that's nice fun. Thank you. Let's see, Brooke. Let's see. Best running back ever is who? Barry Sanders? I, you know what? I can't even dispute that. I would probably go with sweetness, but he was he was pretty good. He was pretty good. And here's the greatest quarterback ever. To 400, Dan the Man Marino for the Dolphins. If only Barry played for like a good team. I mean, that's why he retired or so early, honestly. Cuz he was going nowhere with the with the Lions. But he was saucing on those boys. Yeah, if the man kept on playing, psh, I think he played what? Like 9 9 or 8 seasons in the NFL. And he was breaking records like every single season. I, obviously, I didn't get to watch him play. I mean, I saw him play towards the end of his career when I was a child. But that's the beautiful thing about growing up in this day and age is that everything's on the internet. Oh, dang. I missed this one. Tom Brady to 100 for the Patriots. I really got to put these cards away like as soon as I'm done with the box because then this would just be chaos. All right, let's see. Dang, I wish we had some more Immaculate Collegiate football. Because I did hit a Barry Sanders auto in that, and it was so nice. Well, I missed that one. Keep that there. Do this. You know, and if we're going to talk about my era, you know, considering I was born 89, the first uh, football game I can remember watching was back in 96. Dan Marino was still our quarterback. I think he retired in 99. Um, or 2000 and then Jay Fiedler took over and we you know he held it down for a bit so my running back would probably have to be Ladanian Thomas like that I saw in my time Ladanian Thomas I think I've seen every video there is to see for Barry Sanders. I'm, I'm well aware of just how nasty the man is. Trust me. Oh, that's dope. 
He seems like he's a cool dude. Yeah, he's he's a, sh a short, stocky guy. He's like what five nine, five ten. That's that's why he was able to do what he did. That low center of gravity, he just out there be you know shaking fools left and right. You know, if I would have got in the league, I would have been like Barry Sanders. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to. I don't want to boast, but. Come on. See what's in this box. Two good boxes. Let's keep it going. This is box number three. Dominator for OBJ. It's a 400 Peyton Manning of the Broncos. My boy, LT. What is this? Number five out of ten. Rated rookie Mike Williams. Who I believe is out for the year. That sucks. My boy, that would be a super sick autograph. I mean, I already have a Ladanian Thomas an autograph. Sign the eight by ten for your boy. Cause you know me and LT, we cool like that, you know. Number thirty six and seventy five, Kareem Hunt of the Chiefs. Die cut. What is this? A rated rookie, and it's a good one. For the Giants, numbered 52 and 99, Wayne Gallman. Solid, solid boxes here. Dan Chris Fitz, that, that's kind of that's kind of messed up. Kevin White might actually be might actually catch a pass this season. And Mike Williams probably had a better college career than Kevin White. So so be be a little nicer to my boy. A Pro Bowl game use patch for Rod Woodson of the Ravens. 299. It's a little dirty on there too. Solid solid boxes so far, guys. Three solid boxes. Aikman Auto, LaShawn McCoy Auto, Wayne Gallman Auto. Not bad. Not bad. To 100, Dante Hightower for the Patriots. What's up, TCU?
just waking up in the morning gotta thank god i don't know but the day seems kind of odd no barking from the dogs no smog and mama cooked the breakfast with no hog i got my grub on but didn't pig out finally got a curl for some what what's up tcu julius thomas 27 out of 50 for the dolphins my man i'm expecting big things from a boy right there Expecting big things from a boy right there. Today's going to be a good day, TCU. Kenny Galladay to 100 for the Lions. Number 56 of 80, Jamison Crowder for the Redskins. There you go. Did you actually do that, TCU? I mean, grammar's a little off there, so I'm trying to make sense of what you're saying. Put these cards away. Oh, you did it. You pulled it. Had to respond to CBJ. Apologize for that, y'all. It will be a good day. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, TCU. Any day you wake up is a good day. You mean the, uh, you're probably talking Rod Woodson, uh, Brooke Lopez, if you're talking about the Relic. All right. Sorry, dudes. Had to respond to Jason real quick. 
having some issues in our store, so I'm trying to help him resolve that ASAP. All right, so for those of you on YouTube, uh, Brooke, you is there a lag on your end? Is it YouTube that's lagging, or or what's going on? Because I know I know Breakers TV, you know, lags sometimes, but uh, I've never really gotten a, a complaint from Twitch or YouTube. I know there's a slight delay, but that's about it. So if it's lagging, please let me know. Uh, I would appreciate that. See if I can maybe figure something out, try to resolve it. All right, let's see what this fourth box has for us. To 100, Devontae Adams for the Packers. What else we got here? I see, uh, what is this? Player War Material for the Broncos. Oh, damn. That's a Pro Bowl patch. 1 of 25. Look at that sticking out and everything. DeMarcus Ware for the Broncos. Nice. Numbered 6 of 28, Jonathan Stewart for the Panthers. Number to 100, J.J. Watt for the Texans. Numbered 7 out of 50, Amaro Darbo for the Seahawks.
Number to 100, Matt Ryan for the Falcons. To 75 die cut to Karis McKinley for the Falcons. To 143 for the Falcons as well, Austin Hooper. What is this? What is this? Oh, wow. Fans of the game. A Chris Berman auto. That's kind of crazy. Wow. That's got to be randomed. Sports Card Freak. I know how to do my job. Appreciate you though. Put this away. This is box number five. So that last box was kind of okay. The DeMarcus Ware patch was pretty sick. Pro Bowl. The Berman, I can't lie, is uh. We got a random that deal.
Let's see what's in this box. To 100 Ha Ha Clinton Dicks for the Packers. Can't believe that's his actual name. Ha Ha. That's ridiculous. What what were the short prints, uh, Robert? Oh no, yeah, there's the aqueous test on the back. My uh, my soldiers know about that. It'll say like aqueous test or something like that on the back, across the side. Tom Brady to 185 out of 100. There's not many per case. I mean, we see about two or three per case. But I did not know that those were 25. That's pretty cool, uh, Rob. Appreciate that. Oh, no one knows this year. Okay, I got you. For the Rams to 99, Aaron Donald. Gotcha, Rob, gotcha. So this year, it's kind of just like up in the wind. Nobody knows. What is this? Player-worn material for the Raiders to 99, Khalil Mack. You got to be quicker than that, JRG. You got to be quicker than that. By the way, I don't know if you know, but some people have, like, bots that alert them whenever there's an update on a website. So uh, that's probably why they snipe them so quick. To 400, Marshawn Lynch of the Raiders. Man, they photoshopped them in a Raider uniform real quick. So Sabres saying they're about to 25 as well this year. See a little gold back there, possibly. To 50, Tyrell Williams of the Chargers. I don't think we've seen an autograph yet. And there it is. I believe it is a rookie. Seven out of ten. Patrick. That's Mahomes, the second. I, I tried to make a pun out of it. That's a good card.
let me uh, give my boy the insta top load because that is a good card and not just because they're my home team uh, like legit that could be a huge card all right let's see what else we got in here I think I may have gone through this already. No, I guess not. To 100, Gerald Everett for the Rams. To 43, David Njoku of the Browns. So 100, Todd Gurley the second for the Rams. All right, so we're more than halfway done. And I got to say, we might just have a fairly, I don't want to say it's a hot half case, but it is beyond lukewarm. It might be a little scalding. It might be a little scalding. Oh, dang. JRG has beef with Davis? Oh, dang. I like it. Saber, I can't lie. I mean... My only gripe with it is the sticker autos and the lack of autos, if I'm being completely honest. Uh, um, one box, one relic per box is kind of crazy to me. But given the price point, it's definitely solid. Well, we are not done yet, uh, Robert. We still got four more to go. Oh, yeah, there you go, all savers. The pretty colors, and there's a whole bunch of colors in this stuff. Uh, if anyone's interested, I also have Classics Football. Score Football also has a whole bunch of color in there as well. I got personal boxes available of that if anyone's interested. And Leaf Trinity Football which is collegiate football on card stuff all on card guaranteed numbered very nice very nice stuff kind of reminiscent of that immaculate collegiate Uh, no, Brooke, I would have to make it for you, man. I would have to make it for you, Brooke, so I'm, I'm sorry. All right, 
Let me see what we have here. Let me go through this fairly quickly. To 93, Eric Walden of the Colts. Oh, damn, that is a good card. The fastest man ever in the NFL Combine. John Ross for the Bengals, Patch Auto. RPA, as the kids say. That's a good card. That's a good card. Um, so much so that I got I gotta, I'm going to throw a top loader on that thing. That's a nice card. I'm telling you guys, man, this year's draft class is deep. Well, it would have been Davis. It would have been. The man did run the fastest 40 yards ever. Some would say it was Dion. But, uh, legit, my boy ran like a 4-2. That's true. My time is unofficial, Davis. I mean, in my heyday, I ran a 4-6. You know, when I was actually in some kind of shape when I played football. But that was many moons ago. Over 10 years ago. Number 200, Troy Aikman. For the Cowboys. I'm going to get back in shape. For realsies. Game changer. Changing stripes, I'm sorry. 12 and 99, we got the Jags and the Raiders, Maurice Jones Drew. And yeah, this has to be randomed. Jones Drew. I was surprised he's still even in the league. To be honest, I thought I thought he retired or something. To eighty, haha, -ha Clinton Dix for the Packers. The greatest quarterback ever to 100, Dan the Man Marino for the Dolphins. go die cut 75 for the Bucks Mike Evans no Davis you misspelled Dan Marino but it's okay Patch. I think we're missing a patch. No, we hit we hit a patch in the auto already. Guys, I think we might have a very, very solid half case here. These next three boxes could be some hot fuego lurking in there. Mm. 
number to 10 for the Broncos, Demarius Thomas. To 100 for the Raiders, Derek Carr. Who knows, Brooke? Who knows? Let's see. There might be something crazy in here. I mean, we've been through six boxes. Very solid. Very solid. A Gallman Auto, a Troy Aikman Auto, LaShawn McCoy Auto, Patrick Mahomes Auto, John Ross Auto. Solid, solid so far. Let's see, we got two receivers, two quarterbacks, a running back, and an announcer. I'm going to go ahead and call at least one more running back. The running back is going to be a Hall of Famer. Another quarterback that's likely going to be a rookie. Watch it be like a Deshaun Watson. And then some like other random auto there. Let's find out though. Let's put these away. And find out. Oh, damn. I was like, I need more monster boxes, but they're right here. All right. Next box. Well, these need to be random. that up here
Nice. John Riggins to 100 for the Redskins. Lots and lots of color in this stuff. Some of the numbers are like low key on this stuff. So I like to make sure. To 100, CJ Anderson of the Broncos. Let's see what this box has for us. I don't know, Robert. I'm sorry. We haven't hit the first auto until now. Another receiver to 49, D.D. Westbrook. Clean auto on there for the Jags. That's nice. I will do a recap at the end. Of, uh, of all the autos and stuff. But that D.D. Westbrook was the first auto from this box. If that's what you were asking. To 50 for the Niners. Trent Taylor. To 25, Elijah Hood of the Raiders. Still got to get a relic out of here. We got a die cut for the Rams to 75, Gerald Everett. Hmm, I already know what the relic is going to be. It's going to be a good one. It's on that other stack right there, so let's see what's through here. A, a Ron Donald to 99 for the Rams. Oh, dang, I was mistaken. Unless there's multiple... For the Cowboys, Roger Staubach with the game used relic right there. Okay. I thought this was going to be a relic or something, but it's just a 100. Devontae Freeman or the Falcons. That's what I thought was going to be the relic. Boy, was I wrong. Cowboys picking up some nice stuff.
right. That's it for that box. We got two left. What up, Sands up? What is this number to 100? Joe Flacco of the Ravens. What do we got here? This is a relic. Yup, game worn material for Larry Sanka of the Dolphins. Let's see what the auto will be. To 400, Deion Sanders for the Falcons.
Mm, that Ajayi looks nice, the Dominator. Auto would have been sick. To 50 for the Rams, Tavon Austin. Numbered 275, die cut for the Titans, Marcus Mariota. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. For the Cowboys to 100, Noah Brown. Where is the auto? It's eluding us right now. To 100, Eric Walden are the Colts. What else we can get out of here? To 84, Stephon Diggs. Are the Vikings? What else we got? Mm. If this is the auto, indeed it is. To 99, rookie phenom, Evan Ingram. That's two nice rookie autos for the uh, Giants there. Giants put in work. Got a Gallman and an Ingram. Not bad. As you know, as well as all the color that comes out of this stuff. The 25 Amari Cooper die cut for the Raiders. Right, we got one box left. You know, I did predict at least one more running back, so it'd be nice to be right. Like a McCaffrey. Rated rookie would be crazy. Last box here. Good luck, y'all.
Last box. All right. So, uh, Brooke Lopez, how do you like playing for the New Jersey Nets? Last box mojo, let's do it. To 100, Troy Aikman. That's a nice card to go along with the auto right back there. Hey, brothers, buddies. Nice. Gonna get an auto and a relic from here. The question is, what is it gonna be? Good luck to y'all if you haven't already hit. To 50, Brad Kaya of the Lions. Andy Dalton by the Bengals. out of 50 for the Seahawks Thomas Rawls nice. 
See what else we get out of here, man. Kareem Hunt die cut for the Chiefs to 75. these cards right oh redemption keep that there for my redemption What is this? Well, it's a Broncos for Paxton Lynch to 99 for the Broncos. So that's either Panini points or an auto. We'll find save that for last. I don't think there's points in this. There might be. I mean, we'll find out, though. Let's see what's in the rest of this box. Number to 400, Jim Brown. I like the look of this product. This is very nice. <laughs> Just wish we had more autographs per box. All right, so let's find out what this is. First, let me check, make sure it's not Panini points. It's not, okay. And I don't want to put the code out there for somebody to straight jack it. It is Donruss Donruss, okay. It's a Dominator autograph. Card number 27. Ooh, that's a good one. Le'Veon Bell with the auto. Nice. Solid, a solid nine boxes, if I do say so myself. Now, before I uh, give you guys the, re the recap, we got to random off some cards. This dual relic for the Raiders and Jags of Maurice Jones Drew. And this Chris Berman autograph that we have here. Alright, so. Let me check it out. Where are my dice? There they are. So I'm going to do this thing. For my randoms. We're going 12 times. Ooh, the rare full 12. All right. Move some stuff around. Solid half case, sports card freak. Solid, 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 solid. Let me put some more stuff away here. These are all patches and stuff. I mean, that's a cool one. I'll show you that one. All these I'm going to put away. All right. So, we're going 12 times in our random. Yeah, the optic baseball is good too, man. You know, it's just missing uh, the licensing from the MLB. But other than that, it's real nice stuff. Lots of autos in that. Kind of wish this had, you know, a more autos. All right, so we're doing first, I said it was Jaguars, Raiders. Let me put this thing on the screen. Let 
boom and we're gonna randomize it 12 times good luck to you Jags and Raiders top spot will get the card and the money shot boom it is going to the Jaguars So, the Jaguars Raiders patch going to the Jags. Thanks to our random. There you go. Now, we got to random off the Chris Berman between everyone. That was in the eBay break. So, let me get that list. Let me pull this up. Come on, come on, come on. Waiting on my computer. So here we go. Copy the names. Come into the random. And let me pull it up there it is everyone in the ebay breaks names are listed 12 times this is being random between everybody so top spot will get the chris berman auto good luck And the money shot. Top spot gets the Berman Auto. And is going to Jacob. So congrats to Jacob Mall. We'll be receiving the Berman on top of any other hits that he may have. All right. So the recap that we all want to see, of course. Solid, 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 solid. Let me put these down so I can show you guys. Alright, so I'm going to start you off with a decent looking patch. Numbered to 25 Pro Bowl patch. Three colors for the Broncos. DeMarcus Ware. We got a Dominator Auto Redemption for Le'Veon Bell of the Steelers. Evan Engram RPA for the Giants. Didi Westbrook. To 49 for the Jaguars. Wayne Gallman to 99 for the Giants. And our nice ones. To 25, Dominator Auto, LaShawn McCoy, the Bills. To 10, Rookie Auto for the Chiefs. Patrick Mahomes, the second. RPA for the Bengals to 99. John Ross. And to 10, Hall of Famer. For the Dallas Cowboys, Troy Aikman, Legends of the Fall Auto. Hashtag, that's a nice card. Hashtag, that was a nice break. Thank you all, eBay. We will get this out to you. Thank you very much.